So here we have the scallops, olive oil, pesto, which you don't have to put pesto because I know some people are allergic to pine nuts. Um, you can use just basil, but I had pesto. This is a way that you can cook dinner with what you have. So I always just kind of make it up as I go along and cook with what I have and get creative with it. Okay. In a little bit, I'll add the lemon that I'm cooking the pasta right now. Yeah, so here we have the scallops. They're kind of small, but they're good. And sun-dried tomatoes, which I use the scissors to cut them up. And I put in some of the pink Himalayan sea salt. And yeah, just olive oil. And the pesto oh and garlic yes yes garlic although there's some garlic and pesto but I put additional garlic okay so pretty soon we'll add some other things okay so I have finished the pasta which I will in another video explain to you how I cook pasta perfectly in the microwave okay but right now what I'm gonna do is take this pasta take it over here to my scallops and olive oil pan and put it all in there now some people may not like uh, short pasta but what I do is I break the pasta in half mm -hmm. I break it in half before I cook it and that way it sets up nicely. Yeah. And then you have perfect, perfect uh, size to pick up because sometimes, you know, when the pasta's too long, it like slings around and gets in your face and everything. Okay, so here we go. I have it on simmer, by the way. I have the pan on simmer. So I have browned the scallops in with the sun-dried tomatoes, garlic, and olive oil. I have not added butter. If you prefer butter, by all means, go ahead and do that. Put the butter in there. I just tried it with the olive oil today because I'm conserving my butter. Uh, I don't have that much left in there and I really love butter on bread. <laughs> I think I have like three sticks left or something. I'm saving it for other things. Like vegetables but this is olive oil okay olive oil browned scallops pesto garlic lemon juice okay so with that in mind put a little more lemon juice in there it's a little dry so we want to moisten it want to make it moist you could even add more olive oil, which is what I will probably do. You can add olive oil during the cooking or add it afterwards. Olive oil is really good just as a dressing by itself. Okay, you can add it. Uh, oops, ow, burn my hand. <laughs> you can add it. Um, I'm trying to reach for the pepper. Yes, you could use cracked black pepper or just your regular black pepper in bulk as we go along. Um, anyway, I sometimes love to just drizzle olive oil on pasta and just eat it like that. Maybe with a pinch of salt, sea salt, pink Himalayan salt. Test if your child likes it. Yeah. 